with Chef Ricardo cooking program today. Today we want to show you guys that, you know what I mean, tell you a little bit and tips about Christmas. Christmas is coming up soon. Nice and lovely. Welcome back today, guys. You know, it's amazing to be in the kitchen to give you your favorite dishes. Remember, it's coming up to Christmas and, you know what I mean, there's a lot of things that's been happening at the moment. People have been putting on stuff. The chef has been cooking up Christmas stuff. But basically, today we want to give you some Jamaican pan fried chicken you can even do that for Christmas if you do like it's another tips and another way uh, so you can do something for Christmas because every year we've been doing the same thing is it yes you know what I mean please put your comments down below if you think it is true or you think it is lie every year we've been doing the same thing sometimes it's good to change up and get something different on the menu but um I went to the shop and I get some chicken and to be honest guys the chicken where I get is was like the Thai bit you know what I mean? I get my chicken, if you notice, I remove the bone from the inside and it's only the meat I have right here. And I have roughly about, let me see, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14 pieces inside of this bowl right here. I just get a portion of it because the more you get is the more you more cheaper for me. So, I get some chicken and I say, you know what, let's do some Jamaican style, black people style of pan fried chicken. You know what I mean? Most black people in England, they would normally do something like this pan fry chicken on a Sunday or during the week for their dinner but we want to marinate it first and I just wash it off with some lemon and some white vinegar but we want to get it marinated we want to marinate it and put it on even for two hours for it to soak right over here I got some season which I just cut up some fresh season fresh season is the key for pan fried chicken first of all I want to simply say this is some time this is some lovely thyme right here and if I put my thyme right inside of it like this just to make you guys see this is some ginger fresh ginger this is some red onion this is some spring onion some people call it scallion this is some white onion and this right here is some fresh garlic lovely let's just put the rest of it on it just so you guys can see nice one So. That's all my lovely season I got right here. So I'm using half of a white onion and half of a red onion on it. And I'm gonna marinate it. So basically simple. I have some nut, some season which I'm gonna put also on it. Right here I have a teaspoon, table teaspoon, not tablespoon, teaspoon of all-purpose season. Lovely. And also, I've got some chicken season which I'm gonna put on it also. Teaspoon of chicken season. Lovely. That's chicken season, and that is a teaspoon. Um, I got some everyday season which I'm gonna put also on it. Teaspoon of everyday season. nice one so that's it with all of my season I have some coarse pepper put some coarse pepper on it and um, basically I normally put because I don't have any paprika so you can also put a little paprika if you have at home I'm gonna, gonna pop a little bit of soy sauce the beauty is it you don't need to put any salt because most of these season already have salt so I'm gonna pop a little bit of vegetable oil or if you have olive oil nice so I just put some olive oil on it or vegetable oil wherever you like to use simple use your hand and simple marinate it just like this get all of those season inside of it Looking so lovely and nice, and as you can see, exactly where Chef of God is all about with this nice, lovely pan fried chicken. The bit, the beauty is, it's just under the Christmas tips idea, uh, so you can do for your Christmas. So hopefully, you guys, will like the recipe. Nice one. So you can either leave it in this pan, or I'll give you another idea. I just put a piece of a grease proof paper inside of this tray. And then basically what I'm gonna simply do 
is simple. Just lay them in it like this if you want on a piece of grease proof paper but you don't need to because you're gonna pan fry alright so basically let's put this at the side and this one right here we're gonna just simply leave it straight inside of this all you have to do is just cover it and leave it in your fridge for two hours so guys enjoy the recipe subscribe to the channel and please leave your comments there's another idea and another tips where you can also do for Christmas if any, I, if any information you like, please write it below and we definitely get in touch with you back. If you have anything you want to request for Christmas, let us know. meat soaking and I just like my stove and pop a little bit of vegetable oil inside of the frying pan because it's a pan fried chicken that's one of the key points we need to do and remember as I saying this is just an idea and a tips we can also do for Christmas because on Christmas we always have different kind of meats on the table so first thing what we're gonna do we're gonna simple start frying off the chicken so basically I want to simply say to you, I have my have roughly about 5 to 6 minutes now since I have this on the stove, so probably a little bit hot. Do you hear that fry? And that's exactly what we are all about. That's the chicken. So we're going to pan fry for roughly about 10 minutes and then we're going to finish it off in the oven. Really nice. It smells so good guys, honestly. Mmm. Just, ju just look at that. That is fantastic. So it's another idea, another tips, and another thing where you can do for Christmas and the Christmas dinner table. And hopefully this will be a benefit for you and the family this Christmas. and lovely. I just finished off the chicken but the secret behind the scene is that we're gonna put them in the side of the oven then simple sprinkle a little bit more of the soy sauce on top of it like this just a little bit not too much nice one that's the soy sauce we'll put on top of it and simple just run a little bit of sweet chili sauce on top of it just to give it a flavor and a taste and then you put it inside of the oven but as you can see all the chicken looking lovely and nice guys you can see for yourself that this is not an ordinary pan fried chicken lovely Really nice. So we're gonna put it in the oven. Gas mark seven or six is good for 25 minutes, 20 to 25 minutes. Um, if you're using a different kind of oven, you can turn on your oven for under 65 for 25 minutes also. Um, and then, as you can see, the chicken looking lovely and nice. And we're gonna put it straight inside of the oven. 
and roast finished off in the oven for 25 minutes. Love the chicken, pan fry, chicken, Christmas idea, Christmas tips, which this can use also on the table. That's other as people who don't eat curry goat and roast beef, they can also have a piece of a pan fried chicken. Christmas tips. Nice and lovely. Now the chicken is finished as I can see it inside of the oven. Oh my god, look at that guys. That is marvelous. That is a Christmas chicken. Looking lovely and nice and yummy yummy. Now we're gonna take them out of the oven. Done and dusty guys, looking lovely. As I can see all oh, the chicken looking lovely and nice. As I can see guys, this is what you can do for Christmas also. Enjoy the recipe, subscribe to the channel, I have them in the oven 25 minutes on a medium size eat Yes mark 6 or 7 is good A different oven, 165 for the same minute So enjoy it and see you next time Bye bye Sheared up some of the chicken and planting and rice and some string bean, broccoli, cauliflower, and carrot on the plate. As you can see, oh, it just looking so fantastic, nice, and lovely. So, hopefully, this will be a benefit to someone on a Sunday dinner or a Monday dinner, Tuesday dinner, Wednesday dinner, Thursday dinner, Friday dinner, Saturday dinner, back till Sunday dinner again. So, guys, hopefully, this will be a benefit to you. Enjoy the recipe, subscribe to the channel, and this is the uh, pan fried chicken serve for a nice lovely meal in the evening see you next time bye bye subscribe to the youtube channel thank you for your time and remember christmas we have a lot of idea remember the jamaican rum food cake and sorry so a lot of things is coming for you guys so thank you so much and hopefully you have a wonderful time enjoy yourself and see you in the next time bye, -bye.